Hey, this is Steve from SewingGold.com. Uh, we're going to do a new setup video. We've got these new motors that we bought from Conso. Uh, they come in uh, three-quarter horsepower and uh, one horsepower. So we're going to set this up right now on this table. So this is going to be a table setup video for a lot of different machines. All right, Jose, let's go. So the first thing we're going to do is grab the bolts for the motor, and we're going to put it in three holes. One, two, three. Okay. Next, I'm going to put these rubber spacers there. And now the control arm of the motor. We're not going to tighten the, screw, the uh, nuts once we get it on there, so we're going to do um, washer, lock washer, and then the nut. So we're just going to put these on, but we're not going to tighten them fully because we are going to have to move this a little bit. Okie doke. So now we're going to grab the motor. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is grab this. This. The screw. That's going to go down there. Yeah. But you got to grab all the washers too. Okay. Six. We can screw down just a tiny bit. Yeah, a little, little, just a little bit like that. Excellent. So this is just one. Okay. Move in the middle, something like that. Okay. Yes. And then a washer. Okay. So this piece. Yep. Okay. I think the leave make it stay on. Just push yep. this all the way over. Yes. So lock. we got a washer, lock washer, and then a nut. And we're not tightening anything yet. Okay. Okay. No, just tighten all the way this. Tighten that all the way? Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. Just my hand. Okay. Okie doke. I'm going to align line that, that up. Pulley. Okay, so yes. now we have to line the pulley up. So that's why we wanted you to leave these things loose so we could slide this over a little bit. Like that. Okay. Okay, so now that we've lined the pulley up, so we're lining the pulley up with the hole on the table. Okay. We could have done that earlier, but we can do that now. And this is just a cover to cover the, the Okay, yeah, so you may not even need this, this little piece here. You don't technically need it. It's going to go over the top of this. It's not really necessary. It's not going to hurt yourself with this. Mm. So now we've aligned it. We're going to tighten these nuts with a 14 millimeter wrench. You can use the pliers, whatever you've got.
Okay. And now he's going to grab this 7 eighths inch. Go ahead. I don't need to show that. Actually, let me come around so I will actually show it. So now the motor's done, and then the next we're going to move on to the control panel? Yep. Okay. So we're going to stall this. So right now we're looking at the back of the table right now. Okay, so this is going to be toward the front, facing the front, the electrical, electrical part or the uh, switch. And so our leg is going to go here, so we want to make sure that we don't put the control panel by the okay. leg. So we're just going to use some self-tapping screws that we send along. Okay. Okay. Okay, so now our motor is installed.